Hey everybody, welcome to The Art of Comics. I'm your host, Andre Salzar. Thank you all for joining me today, this new year. What's going down episode of That's My Mama, I Play Joe the Policeman. That's a line from Coming to America. If you haven't seen that movie, you gotta see it. They're making a sequel. I don't know how I feel about that, actually. Uh, Eddie Murphy was great in Saturday Night Live just a week or so. He was good. They pulled out all the stops. They wanted to make sure that was a great show. Um, it was good, but I'm still... I'm wary of all these remakes and rehashes and all that jazz, but... Okay, so what's going down with me this week? Uh, I'm actually recording during the daylight hours. It's like not even noon. And this is my studio. It's actually my work area on that side of the camera is actually, can I do a little flip? I'll do a little flip. On that side of the camera is my work area with my Cintiq and my monitors, and I can't even get to it, Never mind. Forget about it, we'll do a tour another time. Um, so what's been going on with me the last two weeks, I've been hitting hard Shangri-La States, and I've actually uh, I kind of hit a little bit of a breakthrough. I've changed my coloring. Um, I was watercoloring and everything like I did Pariah, but I think I'm going to now go with digital. Um, I grabbed a couple books that I really like, Southern Bastards, a couple others, their palette, their color palette. And so I'm kind of using some of those ideas and color palettes. Uh, I've always gonna, was always gonna do the zip -a tone stuff, so that stays the same. But instead of doing the watercolors on top of that, I might just do some digital coloring. I like it, it's turning out nice. I'm actually, I've done preliminary 50 pages. So I'm on page like 52, which is, I'm actually impressed with that. So we're banging that out. Uh, I also have a really new exciting book that I just started come kind of noodling this new idea. It's gonna be Balls to the Wall, the unfilmable comic book. This is gonna be, uh, you know, something that you just can't make a movie. You cannot adapt it. It's made for comics. So I'm excited about that. It's gonna be the most aggressive thing I've ever done. It's gonna be very Euro comic. It's gonna be very much out there. Um, think of something like Lone Wolf and Cub meets Prophet. If you read the newer versions of Prophet, not the life field, but the most recent Prophet. Do I see it right there in front of me? No, I don't. It's there somewhere. Um, so sci-fi, Euro, alien world, very strange magic, sci-fi stuff, uh, with a kind of a lone wolf and cub kind of story. Anyway, I'm really excited about that because I'm just going to go crazy on that. Very kind of abstract art, kind of go very expressionist stuff on that. I just want to do something beside that's not grounded in reality, like Shangri-La States, you know, 80s southern culture i wanted something a little bit more out there and wild so i'm doing that um i've read a lot of comics i went to a couple shops i went to pulp fiction down in uh culver city i went to spiro's heroes i got a big stack of books i got tons of books to read i got a short box here i got a bunch i've also been reading some wally wood canon we're gonna talk about this in the next couple weeks we're gonna talk about this beast i haven't even opened this i'm just like waiting to crack this open with you guys. Really, really excited, because Bill Sienkiewicz is one of my art people. Uh, I'm also gonna talk about The Few. I just found this in a in a dumpster dive, or what, not dumpster dive, a quarter bin. Uh, just read this this morning. We're gonna talk about this. And we're also gonna talk about Nausicaa. We gotta talk about some freaking Nausicaa. Anyway, so I got some books we're gonna talk about in the next couple weeks. Um, this last couple weeks has been great. Went to LA a couple times. Just really enjoyed my time with my family. Worked on my comics a lot. Read a decent amount to do more videos. Watched The Witcher on Netflix. I'm a big fan of the video game, so I've been digging that. Been playing some Death Stranding on the PlayStation 4. Um, been playing some Lego Batman and Lego Jurassic Park with my little boy. That's been a lot of fun. Co-opness on Steam. What else? Um, watch that Kevin Hart um, little docu-series, uh, which is pretty good. I've kind of been enjoying that kind of stuff. Oh, Johnny Carson podcast. 
there is a podcast out there, it's been it's wonderful, uh, that is recording uh, these, recording his, his like monologue and then a guest. And it's, they're around 20, 30 minutes long. And they're great. I love Johnny Carson. So that's been really fun to watch. I went to Amoeba Records in Hollywood, bought some CDs, uh, realized that no one has CDs anymore or like no one has CD players in cars. So I have to like put them all on my iPod, which is kind of a pain in the ass. Um, I have this new fun toy, the student edition basically of the iPad, uh, which uses the pencil. And I've been doing a lot of my preliminary work in the comics with this bad boy. And that's been a lot of fun because I can basically do my blue line pencil stuff here and use this to then scan and go from here. Or I can color so I can do kind of a preliminary coloring of pages, uh, which is nice. And then go from here to the Cintiq or watercolor. So been really having fun using this as a uh, one of my kind of steps in the workflow to do preliminary stuff. Um, so doing a lot of comic stuff, really enjoying it. Thank you guys so much for watching this quick video. Um, have a great one. Take care. Bye.